Hello everyone, I am KK. In this video, I will tell you how to set path and class path in Windows. Here, I am using Windows 7. I assume that Java SDK and JRE is already installed on your system. Setting path for JDK and JRE is important for Java programs to compile and run. For this tutorial, I am taking a simple program. This simple program displays some output. I am going to compile this program through the command prompt by typing Java C and the file name of the Java program. This shows error saying Java C is not recognized as an internal or external command. This is because that the path for Java C or Java is not set. To set the path, you can select computer, right click it, select properties from the window open, click on the advanced system settings on the top left corner of the window. This pops up system properties with selected advanced tab. Click environment variable in the environment variables, you have two options of setting user variables and system variables. It is better to set path in system variables. You may or may not have path variables inside the system variables. Let's see. I already have the path variable inside system variables. If you already have the path variables, then you can click edit after selecting the path variable otherwise you need to create new path variable by clicking the new button here you can write the variable name path and here the value of the variable but we already have the path variable inside system variables so we will select the path variable and click the edit button under system variable path will be under the variable name and you need to provide the path of the folder where JDK and JRE is installed you might already had the path inside the variable values please do not delete this path just try to append this path you can type the complete path but it is better to browse the location and copy the path. I have installed Java under C drive program files. We need to browse till JDK bin folder and select the entire path from the address bar. Copy the path from here and paste it at the end of the existing path by appending it after the semicolon placed at the end of the existing path. For JRE, we need to again append the path followed by semicolon. Browse till JRE bin folder, select the entire path from the address bar, copy it and paste it in the variable values. Now click OK and you will find the path appended. Now we need to set class path. You may or may not have class path variable inside the system variables. If you already have the class path variable then you can add it else you have to create a new variable by clicking the new button and create a class path. In my case, I do not have the class path variable. I will click new button and create a class path. Now we need to provide the path of JDK and JRE. I have installed Java in C drive program files Java for JDK browse JDK folder bin copy entire path from the address bar 
and paste it then append a semicolon now for jre we need to browse till jre bin folder copy entire path from the address bar and paste it in the variable value appended by a semicolon and a dot at the end click ok here also click ok and finally click ok and close the system properties also close all the command terminals if they are open now open the new command window and try to compile the java program you can see the program has compiled you can execute the java class file as well that the file output hello java in case if you are getting the error as java c not recognized as an internal or external command then you need to recheck your java path as well as the class path if you enjoyed please like and subscribe thanks for your valuable time thanks for watching